files coaching application from Google Play Store. If you are an Apple user, then download My Institute app and enter code I E L T S IELTS. On home page, click on Store and choose Speaking Booster. Click in Buy Now and Pay Online to unlock the book for next six months. And that's it. You're done. Happy buying. Describe an indoor or outdoor place where it is easy for you to study. One of my favorite places to study is a quiet corner of the park near my home. It's a peaceful outdoor spot that's just right for focusing on my schoolwork. I go there often, especially when the weather is nice. This part of the park is surrounded by trees and greenery which makes it feel calm and relaxed. I love listening to the sound of leaves rustling and birds singing while I study. It helps me concentrate and feel more at ease. What's great about this spot is that it's quiet and free from distractions. Unlike busy places like cafes or libraries, the park gives me space to think clearly and work without interruptions. Plus being outside in the fresh air feels really refreshing and helps me stay alert. There are benches and tables in the park where I can sit comfortably with my books and laptop. And the best part is there is free Wi-Fi so I can access the internet whenever I need to look something up or do research. Studying in the parks make me feel more focused and productive. I find it easier to remember things and stay on track with my work. Plus, being surrounded by nature makes studying feel more enjoyable and less boring. One day I had to write a report about protecting the environment and studying in the park was the perfect inspiration. Being outside and seeing all the trees and flowers made me feel really motivated to learn more about and do my best on the assignment. Overall, the park near my house is my favorite place to study. Describe a person who thinks music is important and enjoys music. Music touches everyone's heart and there are some people who have an entirely different connection with music. I would like to talk about my cousin Simran who truly believes that music is incredibly important to him. Right from his childhood, it's evident that he has a talent or a gift as he possesses a melodious voice and has shown interest in music since a very young age. Not only has he been interested in music since childhood, but he has also excelled in playing musical instruments. He was only five years old when he started learning to play the harmonium. At a very young age, he participated and won accolades in school music competitions. He believes that music is one of the best way to share emotions. Whenever he is not in a good mood, he expresses his feeling through musical notes. Simran is not just a performer, but also a composer. He writes music, sings, and even creates videos on his own. Recently, he started his own YouTube channel where he regularly uploads his music videos, and people appreciate his work. He has gained over 50,000 subscribers. He aspired to become a professional musician one day and want to focus on music full time. That's why he chose music as a major subject in college. Currently, he is doing exceptionally well and I hope he becomes a renowned musician in our country one day. He is the epitome of someone deeply interested in music and consider it extremely important. Describe an important plant in your country. Well, India is very famous for its rich vegetation and there is a wide range of plants available in my country. But here I would like to talk about basil, which is one of the most important plants in my country. It is grown in almost every part of my country because it does not need any specific climate condition and can grow almost anywhere. According to Hindus, it is considered a very auspicious plant which is why most people in my country to love it to grow it in their houses it is an important part of every garden i must say it is not a very wild plant so it can be also grown 
in a small pod. This plant is used for many different purposes. First of all, it is used as an ingredient in different cuisines, especially in Indian cuisines. Basil plants are used as an ingredient because of their special taste and fragrance. At the same time, this plant has some medicinal properties as well. So it is often used to make Ayurvedic medicines. The extract of basil also helps to improve immunity, especially in young children. Since it is very helpful in improving immunity, people often keep the extract of basil and put a few drops in the cup of tea or milk. It comes in a wide variety and has more than 150 species. Last but not least, it has a wonderful fragrance so it is also used in the perfume industry for making scents and fragrances. Overall, it is one of the most important plants in my country. Describe a person who likes to buy goods at low prices. Different people have different ways of spending money. Nowadays, many people spend a lot even on things they don't really need. However, I would like to talk about my uncle who is quite careful with his money. I really admire he manages to find things at very low prices. My uncle often reminds me that we need to spend our money wisely. He says there are many brands and stores that try to charge too much. He tells me to be smart and figure out the real prices of things and to look for discounts. He believes that whatever he buys is usually much cheaper than expected. While most people prefer shopping at fancy malls or expensive stores, my uncle prefers visiting factory outlets of major brands. There he finds the same products at much lower prices usually about 40 to 50 percent. He doesn't mind buying used items either. He regularly checks online platforms like OLX and if he finds something in good condition at a better price than a new one, he buys it. Recently, he even bought a second-hand car that looks almost new at a great price. My uncle also suggests using online shopping platforms like Mantra, Amazon, especially during their sales. He says we can find great deals there. He is always comparing prices on different platforms and buys from where he can get the lowest prices. That's how he manages to save a lot of money. Describe a place or a city or a town that is good for people to live in. There are many prospering cities in my country which are good to live in. Given a chance, I would definitely recommend Chandigarh to someone who wants to settle in as it is also my dream to live in this city for good after completing my studies. Chandigarh is definitely the city beautiful as it is the most well-designed city of India. It is actually the capital city of two states, Haryana and Punjab, and you can expect that it really has a wonderful infrastructure. To live in, a person needs a city with good infrastructure in terms of medical facilities, educational institutes, good roads, public transportation and others. This city has it all. Apart from this, Chandigarh is also known for its pleasant weather. It is in the foothills of Himalayan mountains and that is the reason why the weather always remains pleasant here. Chandigarh is also the most prospering and developing cities. It is also known as the Silicon Valley of this area. And there are lots of job opportunities in IT sector and businesses also flourish here. Most job seekers head towards Chandigarh for a better life. At the same time, high earnings of this city also ensure that you enjoy a high standard of living. Of course, youngsters these days also look for entertainment aspect when they think of settling down. And this city is certainly worth it as there are restaurants, clubs, malls and many other things that people can explore on the weekends and have a good family time and fun. Overall, considering all these aspects, I must highly recommend City Chandigarh to those who want to settle.